What's up guys? I have some really exciting news that I wanted to share with you guys. I don't know how many of you guys follow Gary V, but being an entrepreneur myself, he is somebody that I have looked up to, have admired. He had posted on Instagram about a week ago that he was going to be hosting like a secret event in LA this week and to stay tuned for it. And then yesterday he posted a video with the details saying that comment below on this video and I'm going to choose 15 people at random to attend attend this secret event in LA and guys I literally have never won anything in my life like not even like a scratch off lottery ticket but if you don't try you the answer is always going to be no so I commented on it just saying hey Gary you know I'd be so thrilled to come just like the million other people that commented the same exact thing and within like five minutes I got a freaking notification from Gary V that I had been invited like by God's will I had been invited out of all these people to attend this event that's happening tonight I still have no idea what the event even is I just got details on the location and the time it's tonight from 6 to 9 p.m. Um, in Hollywood that's all I know I'm hoping that I can vlog a little bit and like bring you guys along with me we'll see um, I asked for the dress code it said there was none I have no idea what I'm in for but I am just feeling so excited for this experience this is going to be so huge and I'm just so thrilled and thankful I literally even <laughs> screenshotted the notification so that I can like see it forever he tagged me Karen Nicole well you won you're in <laughs> I'm like ah! I am so freaking excited I truly believe that everything happens for a reason there's a reason that I got selected to attend this event tonight and I'm definitely feeling really grateful and I'm going to make the absolute most of it. Now I need to head home from the gym, get a bunch of work done and pack because we are leaving for San Antonio tomorrow. We're doing a meetup while we're out there so I'm hoping that I'll get to meet some of you guys out there. If any of you guys are local to the San Antonio area, comment below and let me know if you're going to come to our meetup. Post-workout meal is a combination of chicken and egg whites mixed with a half a cup of rice and some asparagus that I seasoned with turmeric and cayenne doing a little meal prep for San Antonio. I did have some bite meals delivered to Heidi's house, but need some food to travel with. So I'm cooking up two pounds of 99-1 extra lean ground turkey. I'm going to bake some asparagus, get some rice going in the rice cooker. I like to keep my meals extra simple when I travel. It's just the easiest and most mindless thing for me to do. So that's how I do it. And I'm going to be portioning things into small Ziploc bags instead of Tupperware just to conserve space in my bag. And those are my little travel tips. YouTube subscribers that want to know methods for dealing with constipation. I wasn't constipated, espresso. but espresso does the trick. It really does. <laughs> Coffee for me, like I'll poop right away. Yeah. Comment below if you have those girlfriends that you can feel comfortable talking about your poop <laughs> stories with. <laughs> She's gonna leave this in the video. I am. I believe you. I will leave this in the video. <laughs> You're like, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> Four meals. Ground turkey, asparagus, couple portioned out baggies of almonds. Each one I marked down is eight grams of fat. I've already weighed them out. Got my rice cakes, which are super easy to track and travel with. One rice cake is seven grams of carbs each. And that will do it for my travel meals. All right, guys, I'm at Raleigh Studios in Hollywood, walking over to stage six. That's all I know. That's the only direction I have. It was like high security to get in here. I have no idea what I'm in for. Okay, I don't know if I'm allowed to be doing this, yeah, but good. Good. I'm doing it. I found a familiar face, guys. <laughs> right, so they just let us inside. Still have no idea what is about to go down. Probably a lot of. Any thoughts on what you guys? Think? I have no clue what to expect. Any thoughts? I think we're just gonna be a live audience and get some really valuable knowledge from me. 
Sounds good enough for me. Alright guys, an incredible experience here tonight with Gary Vee. Thank you so much You're for welcome. having me here tonight. I loved everything that he said tonight, but one thing that really resonated with me was when you talked about how we can control our hustle. I get so many people asking, how do you accomplish this, how do I do that, how do I do that? You work. Yeah, work your hustle. Work. Yeah. Anything else you want to say to my channel, Gary? Yep. Work. <laughs> Thank you. You guys ready for Texas? Oh, almost. <laughs> Just finished cooking and both of them are like sitting on their suitcases trying to get them shut. This mush here is cream of rice, egg whites cooked in, see last vlog for instructions, and some nut butter. I don't know. Girls are eating breakfast and our flight's delayed about an hour. How's that bite, Randy? Mm -hmm. mm. Don't film me while I'm eating. <laughs> if you guys want to know a little bit more about me, I'm going to show you without even ever having to say anything. Oh, perfect. It's explanation. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. Her socks oh. are different. <laughs> Stop talking. No words needed. Really glad that... Um, God blessed me with friends that are equally as weird as I am. We don't judge you. I get really angry when people judge people for having different colors. So we are off to what? San Antonio for the weekend. We're gonna be there until Monday, just for like a big, epic girls weekend. We're so excited. We're also doing a meetup on Saturday, so if any of you guys are local to the San Antonio area, hope to see many of you guys there. It's going to be Saturday from one to four at Burnett and 30 Gym. First stop, coffee. Just a single shot of espresso for me. Let's find the girls. Are you girls excited? My espresso kicked in. <laughs> Meal number two, going down on the plane. <laughs> Out of my fancy Ziploc bag. Rice cakes. And yes, I brought my massive jug as well. Stay hydrated. Prep life. Yeah. Prep feels. Em, how you feel walking past all these good smells? I smell Cinnabon from like a mile away. Yeah, same. We have arrived in San Antonio, and I've determined that the worst places to be when you're on prep are in the airport and powerlifting competitions, because there's just carbs everywhere. All the smells. All the smells. luggage into one car so half of us are here in the car with Heidi and half are in an Uber but we are all going to meet up at Heidi's place and then we're waiting on Noel, Katie, Emily Duncan and I think that's it right? Yeah. <laughs> Stocked up all my meals for the week. This one is three ounces chicken asparagus. I ordered some bulk chicken, some bulk fish, some bulk rice, some bulk sweet potatoes, and also veggies by the pound as well. That's just the easiest way for me to do it. Keep it simple while I travel. And looks good. Okay, so I'm gonna do some chicken and asparagus. I ordered rice by the pound so I'm gonna weigh out half a cup into this meal and this is going to be my pre-workout meal before us girls head to the gym all the girls are just unloading the rest of their food into the fridge Heidi's rummaging through the snacks <laughs> she's like did you see my snacks let's see your snacks but I have like cookies croissants Oreos candy chocolate Skittles Starburst I'm so sorry Chocolate, show us Lindor. the door. Ooh, espresso chocolate. Yeah. Did you ever set? Oh. Are you gonna take one too? What? Yeah. Marie, do you want a pre-workout shot?
My channel knows that this is my favorite exercise. <laughs> what, what's the benefit of the band? Um, it helps with glute activation. So every time you hit a rep, just focus on pushing your knees out, and that's gonna keep those glutes activated throughout the entire exercise. I'm out of breath. <laughs> awesome, love it. Ooh. Tell my boss that I'm done Had no luck with my mom Say what will you do with your life You know it's hard to survive A cigar in my mouth Maybe guilty but proud Now I'm an outlaw on the run Dangerous but it's so fun Running, running of cardio, which should take me about 45 minutes. I'm gonna join Emily on cardio right now. And it's so hard to get in after leg day, but it must be done. Been sitting on a plane all day, so I know it'll feel good once I get in the zone. Thanks for training with me, ladies. Sucks while you're doing it. So it's really good after. 20 more minutes. 